Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the event ID 41 error in Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to check for Windows 11 updates. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and then make sure to click on Windows update on the left pane and then on the right side click on the blue check for updates button. Now Windows will try to scan for the best updates for your PC and then install them automatically. After installing these updates, you can restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run the Power Troubleshooter. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon, and then make sure to click on System on the left pane, and then on the right side, scroll down until you find the Troubleshoot category and click on it. Now in here, click on Other Troubleshooters, and afterwards, scroll down until you find the Power section and click on the Run button corresponding to it. Windows will now detect any issues and fix them as soon as possible. You can then restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to adjust the power settings. To do this, press the Windows button, then type in Edit Power Plan and select it from the search results. First of all, in here you can choose when to put the computer to sleep. So in here, on both battery and plugged in, you can choose to set it to never, which means that the computer will never go to sleep. At the same time, if you click on the Change Advanced Power Settings, a new Power Options window will open. And in here you can also fiddle with the Hard Disk option. As you can see, if you open it, you have an option that says Turn off Hard Disk After. So both on battery and plugged in, make sure to choose a lengthy period of time, so it won't shut down after 10 or 20 minutes. Lastly, after inputting a longer value, make sure to click on Apply and OK to save the changes. You can then restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to disable the fast startup feature. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type Choose a power plan and then make sure to select it from the search results. Now in here, on the left pane, make sure to click on Choose what the power buttons do. And as you can see, if you want to turn off the fast startup, first of all, you'll see that it's grayed out. To change that, click on Change settings that are currently unavailable and then simply untick the box next to turn off fast startup. You can then click on the save changes button and restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run a system file scan. To do this, press the Windows button, then type in CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. Now in the command prompt window, make sure to type in the following commands as found here or copy them from the description below, but press enter after each command. Note that the scans can take a bit of time, so don't lose patience. Afterwards, restart your computer and check if the problem is solved. And lastly, another useful solution is to simply reset your PC. To do this, press the Windows button, select the settings icon, and then make sure to click on System on the left pane, and then on the right side, scroll down until you find the Recovery section and click on it. In here, under Recovery options, you have an option that says Reset this PC. So click on the button that corresponds to it. Now in here, make sure to choose a preference for your resetting procedure and then make sure to confirm by resetting your PC. Afterwards, after the PC will be reset, make sure to check if the Event ID 41 error will still show up. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.